All right, pros, we are on to week four of Isolate. Mel is back to keep crushing that with us. She's killing it with you guys, so keep that pace. We got it. We're gonna do a little bit of a warm up. You guys should know the method definitely by now. Let's change up some of these drills a little bit just to give you a new kind of taste. Um, and yeah, let's see what you guys got. So happy Isolate round four. Let's do some good arm circles just to get yourself in the game. If you guys wanna, again, loosen up a little bit more, just go run the treadmill for a quarter mile, go run outside for a quarter mile, whatever works for you guys. All right, sink yourself down. Let's take your time with it. Sit in that really good kind of groin stretch. And you're gonna even put the arms in between your thighs and push it out. As long as you guys are warmed up enough, it's a really good opportunity to stretch before we engage all eight drills. Good. And then you guys can do a good down dog. Take your time. Perfect, keep breathing. Awesome. And then drop into a really good up dog, guys. That lower back, stretch it out. We won't go crazy with the stretching now. We'll do a little bit more at the end. But just enough to make sure your joints are good, the muscles we're about to work are ready to go. Stretch the hamstrings. Good. And then let's just do a really good hip flexor stretch. So that one leg at a time. Step yourself out. Sink yourself down into it. Yeah, good. And then you can open and close. Go forward and back. Awesome. Keep breathing. Get ready. So for today's class, guys, you want dumbbells, light. You want a band. Get another leg. You want a band. And you want a tube if you have it. If you don't have the tube, you can do the exercise that we're going to do with dumbbells. That works too. And then you guys have a mat. So that's it. Nothing crazy. Good. All right, let's go back to that good down dog one more time. Perfect. You can widen out that stance and walk yourself back. Nice and easy. Stretch the hamstrings again. Stay at that bottom there. Just kind of bouncing up and down a little bit. Get it. And then come up nice and easy. Roll those shoulders back. Good, cross over and under again. Whew. All right, let's go. Same method, four levels of intensity. Let's start with your first exercise, legs. Good. Guys, we're on to number one. So what I want you guys to do, we're gonna focus mostly on legs here, but the arms have to stay engaged just to hold be resistant to up in this position, okay? Again, if you don't have the tube, that's fine. Just grab the dumbbells and you can hold them close. We are gonna do close stance ski squat. So a little bit more than shoulder width apart for your feet. Put that weight up to here. If you have the tube, you want to try to get it on the inside. So flip on the inside, well, there you go. Yeah, yeah. perfect. Inside, just so you know the weight is really focused on in instead of going out. And I want you to keep that position here as you go that full range. Sink back down into it and then drive yourself up. Just don't bow forward, all right? Make sure your knees are definitely, you can see your shoelaces the whole time, so keep your knees back and really get that butt back and chest up, okay? Again, dumbbells I'll take, and the arms are gonna kill, just holding this position. Let's see what you guys got. Three, two, one, let's go. So we're definitely hitting the legs now, but just by holding that there, squeeze the arms, we'll wake up those arms as well. First level of intensity, you have 50 seconds, ski squats, good job. Kick net game today, guys. See what you guys got. It's perfect, Mel. Close stance. Good. You can see her form. She really does sink back. Perfect. And it drives up. You don't have to go down too far. You have that butt back, chest up, drive up. Squeeze those biceps. If the arms are killing, just rest them for a second. Come right back at it. Good. 15 seconds left. Good fight. Stay with it, guys. Chop down. Eight seconds left. Remember, you're trying to breathe. When it is hardest, so you can drop down and exhale. So exhale when you come up, or inhale when you come up, or exhale when you come up. So inhale when you drop down, exhale up. Inhale down, exhale up. Two, one, good five. 10 seconds to break. Okay, now let's do the pulses in sets of eight. So I want you to pulse now for the second level of intensity, but get down and pulse for eight, and then drive yourself up. Okay, ready? Two, one, let's go. Get down, pulse for eight. And this one you kind of breathe throughout. You know? And then drag yourself up. Okay. Do it again. Those arms are gonna fire up. You're gonna shorten the resistance of that band so it won't be too hard here. But the second you drive back up, you gotta keep those arms tight. Good job. Get these quads to warm up. 
This is definitely a big compound movement here, guys. We've got a lot going on with muscle contractions. Good fight. 20 seconds left. Let's get done. We're do the same idea with holding, guys. Perfect. Stay with it. Good, good, good. 10 seconds left. So again, guys, everything's broken up into 50 seconds with 10 seconds to break. Four levels of intensity for all eight drills. Two and one. Good fight. 10 seconds. All right, next set. So same idea. Count slow for this one, guys. Get down. Hold this position for eight seconds. Drive yourself up. When you're down there, you're just don't just sit and hold. You want to sit, hold, and squeeze. Everything, squeeze. Concentrate on the muscles you're working. Two, one, let's go. Drop down. Stay. Breathe. Focus on posture. Do not let yourself drop. When you get tired, just come up and shake it out. Good? Eight seconds at the bottom, and then you can stand up. Good. Try to keep those elbows as much as you can left in. Perfect. If you guys are doing this with dumbbells, just hold those dumbbells nice and tight and squeeze those biceps. Show off those guns. Squeeze those biceps. Come on. Stay with it. 20 seconds left. Good fight. Round three already, guys. Stay with it. Come on. Good job, now. Good form. Your chest is up. Shoulders are back. That's perfect, guys. Stay with it. 10 seconds left. Good. Stay really close, stance. You guys have that too. Be sure to step it right on it. Two, one, good Woo. job. All right, one more. Now we're gonna do that big power set. That slow going down. So get that really good inhale when you're dropping down. Four count, and then bah, power yourself up. That's what you wanna drive. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Down, four, three, two, one, bah. Good, exactly. Stay with you guys. Come on, remember there's no hits in this class. This is just where you're gonna find that power is in that fourth level of intensity. Where you're gonna find that big explosive up without jumping, right in this fourth level of intensity. Stay with it. Uh, so really drive up, come on. Slow down, concentrate on the eccentric, and then power the up. Nicely done, come on. 15 seconds left, good job. Almost done with your first one, guys. Good fight, stay with it. Yeah, no, finish it. Keep those arms up, guys, come on. You're still getting those arms involved, squeeze. Five seconds left. Good fight. Two, one. Nicely done. Good job. Shake it out for a second, guys. We're gonna put the band on now. Good work. Guys, we are on to exercise two. Band should be on. You're gonna put it right above your kneecaps as always. I want you guys to give me one good sumo squat. And on the top of the sumo squat, you're gonna lift one leg. And then do the same idea. Sumo squat, lift the other leg. It's gonna be the first level of intensity. Same idea with the pulsing, same idea with the holding, same idea with the power. First one, ready? Three, two, one. Let's go, so full range, get down, pick it up, bah. No need to rush, just try as best as you can to get that good squat and that good side lift. When you do the side lifts, make sure you're not internally rotating, make sure you're not externally rotating. You want directly, bah, to the side, good? And you can do it when you get to the top. Some of you that are a little more advanced can do it as you're coming down. Wow, okay? Slow, steady, take your time. Halfway, good fight. Keep alternating, nice. Awesome, guys, and focus on that squat. The sumo squat, a little bit of a wider stance squat with the band on, really kicks in those glutes, guys. Stay with it. And again, break the 90 degrees. You guys know this for sure. If the butt goes past that 90 degrees, then you're really kicking in the glutes to get yourself up. If you stay up here, it's hips. Almost, two, one, good fight. 10 seconds, break it out. Same idea, we're gonna alternate, but at the top, we're gonna pulse for four on each side, okay? Good fight, two, one, let's go. Round number two, we're gonna try to keep that pace now today, guys, we're doing good. Yeah, the balance is gonna come to key here now, guys. So squat, get up, lean into it, two, three, four, do it again, take your time. Every single movement you're doing here should be really contracting these legs. Don't get much of a rest set now. When you're standing up, you're pulsing that one leg. Keep alternating. Stick with fours. Yeah, man, let's go. 20 seconds left. Always remember good upper body posture. So try not to do this. You want to always really good tall posture. Shoulders always back. Perfect, guys. 10 seconds left. Good. 
Let's see how well you guys do with that hold in a second. Good place. Hold. Two and one. Good job. Same idea. Let's count for a slow four at the top of those holds now, okay? But keep all three. Ready? Two, one. Let's go. Down. Get up. Hold. Count your head. Count your head. Don't lose the form. Drop. Do it again. Count your head. Don't lose the form. Find that balance. Yeah. Good. Really squeeze. When you're holding, guys, keep that leg up and squeeze. When you decide that's up, squeeze that really good stable leg that's got to fire up just to keep you stable, keep you balanced. Good. Wake up these legs, guys, big time. Pack the way. Good fight. Keep alternating. Count your head. Four, three, two, one for the holds. Good. Perfect fight. Come on. You guys have 12 seconds left. Nicely Good reps, guys. Got one more level of intensity. This one will pick up the pace a little bit just to find that power for the up. Five, two, one. Nicely done. Okay, so you're gonna go down really slow in the spot, and then I want you to pick up that power, pop it up. Good, and then come back down, do it again. Slow some down, and then drive up. Bah, other side. Good. Two, one. Let's go. Slow the down. That's the eccentric. And then you want to stick with that big pop up. See if you got that leg to lift. And get it up as high as you can. If you're stacking like around here, try to get up just an inch or two more. Come on. Come on. Yeah, perfect. Count the four, three, two, one to go down. Remember, always fours and eights are good counting measures. Keep it on beat. Same with you guys. Halfway. Big drive up, kick it out. Good job. Awesome work, guys. Killing it. Good fight, girl. Come on. Steady up that breathing. No, just stop breathing, guys. 15 seconds left. Yeah. Remember, stay directly lateral. Don't rotate in. Don't rotate out. Come on. Five seconds left. Finish it. Come on. Good fight, good fight, good fight. Almost, guys. Two, one. Power up. There you go. Good finish. Awesome, guys. Let's go on to number three. Let's hit the arms now. To the third exercise, guys. Grab your dumbbells now. Something light. You don't have to go crazy with this, guys, because we're going to do anterior presses. So that's like you're going to keep your hands pretty close together in front of you so your knuckles are facing your face. And you're going to go full range, just like this. It's a lot harder to do than just opening up wide with less muscles involved. Just keep them nice and close. So let's see what you guys got. First one, all the way up. Come down nice and easy. Squeeze the core. Softly bend those knees. Good fight. Ready? Two. One, let's go. Whoa, all the way up. Come all the way down. All the way up. Come all the way down. Good. You guys can even do this with a tube if you want. So if you do have a tube at your house, the resistant tube, you guys can step on that stuff or do the same idea. Close, it's going to be a little bit harder. Good. Your biceps will kick in here too. A really good one for fighters. <laughs> good way. You're halfway. Squeeze that core always, guys. That is the center part of your body. It'll help you out with all these exercises. And especially in isolate, you want to be lighting up the majority of your muscles. So squeeze here, squeeze the shoulders, squeeze the biceps, and just breathe. Keep going. Five seconds left. Nice. Two, one. Good set. Okay, shake it out. You're going to stay here now the full time and pulse. Right at that 90 degrees. So right like by your eyebrows to the top of your head. Eyebrows, top of your head, pulse. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Good. Just a little. Pop. 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 Squeeze. If you need a break, shake it out. Come right back at it. So let's see if you can go the whole time. Good. Yes, yeah, steady up that breathing. I'm telling you, even the light set of weights or those water bottles or those cans that you guys have, they start to add up, guys. With this level of intensity, this four to this level of intensity, they will definitely challenge a super light set of weights. Good fight. This is how we keep you guys clean. This is how we keep you guys nice and sculpted here. Really good compliment to these Barsky Boot Camp guys. Badass. Stay with it. You have eight seconds left. Yeah, bro. Pulse it. Right here. Come on. Come on. Good fight. Come on. Two, one. Woo. Perfect. Okay, the next Woo. one. Same idea if you're just holding it. So just look at your forearms, right in the middle of them. That's where your eye level is. Keep the elbows up. Stay here and squeeze. Don't drop them down. Keep them up. Ready? Two, 
One, let's go. <laughs> nice, easy. Again, guys, you can be doing this with a tube. That will be a lot harder just to pull that position with a heavy resistance. But even light dumbbells should really be adding up by now. So good fight. Shake it out where you have to. Come right back at it. You gotta squeeze. Put that mind on all those muscles you're working right now. Shoulders, biceps, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Halfway, good fight. Steady it out, shake it out if you have to. Come right back at it. Come on, come on, squeeze bear down, fight it out, guys. Come on. You have 15 seconds left. Good job. Stay with it, guys. Awesome. Eight seconds. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Squeeze that core. Good fight, almost. Two and one. Woo, you're done. Good. Okay. Now you're going to pop the up. Pop all the way. And then take your time coming down into it. Get back. Just, just pass that line. You're going to pop slow down. Ready? Two, one. Let's go. And that four count coming down. Four, three, two, one. Pop. Good. Squeeze. Squeeze. This is done, guys. Really good fight. Number three. Getting it done. Good pace, you guys. Stay with it. Always engage the core. Never back extend. Soften up those knees. That's your support base. Half way. Finish it. Big pop up. <clears throat> Take your time coming down. Find whatever that power is you guys got today. Good job. You guys have 15 seconds left. Pop. Good fight now. Hell yeah. Almost, guys. Come on. Eight. Seconds left. Good, good, good. Close, close, close. Two, one. Good finish, guys. Awesome work. On to the next. We're staying with the arms, guys. Good job. On to drill number four. Keep those dumbbells, guys. We're doing L raises. So I want one in front, one right to the side. So you're drawing that L, okay? So you're gonna have on your thigh and on the outside of the thigh lift. And then right away, switch to the other L. That's gonna be the first level of intensity, that first minute, okay? You guys ready? Two, one, let's go. So you get up, control. This is gonna light up those shoulders and because of where we're directing the dumbbells, your core has to engage, it's not twist you around, right? So squeeze, pick up, squeeze, pick up. Breathe, you gotta keep remembering to breathe in this class, guys. Do not hold your breath. Let's go. This is an oxygen restriction, you know? Good fight, halfway. Perfect. So one in front, one right to the side. Take your time, squeeze the core. No need to go any higher than just level of the ground, guys. Good. 10 seconds left. Perfect. Come on, come on. Good fight, good fight. You guys have three, two, and one. Okay, we're gonna switch up a little bit for the second level. And let's actually do one side for 25 seconds and then the other side for 25 seconds. I want you just to stay. Let's go left in front, right to the side, and you're gonna pulse. Stay here for 25 seconds. Ready? Two, one, let's go. So pick it up exactly. Pulse, squeeze. So you're just going that short range, hovering right at that parallel to ground mark. And just bounce up and down. Good fight. 10 seconds, let me switch, good job. So try as best you can, guys, to watch your posture. You don't wanna shrug your shoulders up, right? Keep them down, chest is always up, shoulders are back. And then you just do it up and down. Two, one, good fight, right away, other way, come on. The other side of that L, same idea, so you're right to the front, your left directly to the side. Good, squeeze the core. Let's go, shoulders, they're hugely involved with anything you guys do upper body. You're focused on the chest day, shoulders are involved. You're focused on the back day, shoulders are involved. So we gotta get those shoulders nice and strong. Here we Two, one, 10 seconds, the same idea, let's hold, okay? Same idea, hold. Let's go back to left to front, right to side. Two, one, let's go. Good. Round number three, our intensity level number three. Good fight. Squeeze. Okay, so again, guys, this might be light, and it might be easy for you to stay here, but if you engage those muscles and you really squeeze them, you guys force yourself to do the work here, you're gonna feel a lot more sore the next day if you put effort into it, right? Stay with it. You guys have three, two, one. Good night. Same idea. Other side. Squeeze. Go. No need to rest. Come on. Really 
Put that focus, put your mind onto those shoulders. Let it up, squeeze your four as well. 15 seconds left. Awesome fight, guys, good work. We're almost hitting that halfway mark, guys. Stay with it, come on, eight seconds left, now let's go. Good, squeeze, 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 squeeze. Three, two, one. Ooh. One more level of intensity. Ooh. Now let's go back to alternating, but do the power of the up, okay? So pop the up, so squeeze your tries coming down, switch, pop, take your tries coming down. Two, one, let's go. So one more level of intensity here, guys. Good fight. This is the explosiveness and that concentration on the eccentric. Eccentric's like that negative, right? Got it. So take your time on this and drop them down. This is where you tell gravity that you make that lesson, right? Come up, back. Take your time. Come down. Good. Stay with it. Half. Well. Good job. Squeeze the core. Always. Especially to get to that top. And you stop it, you want those shoulders to just wah, tighten up. Other side. Wah, tighten up. Take your time. Come down. Good job. Ten seconds left. Good work. Stay with it. Keep those good strong L's every time. You're almost there. Two, one. Good fight, guys. Hell yeah. Okay, let's keep these dumbbells, guys. We're gonna go right this little in-between drill. Just to kind of really exhaust these arms some more before you get back to the legs. So good fight. Perfect. Okay, guys, keeping those dumbbells, drop to your knees. Don't sit back on your heels. So stay up nice and strong. Squeeze your core always. We are going to go to circle drills, forward rotation, back rotation. We're going to do the open and close, and then we're going to do over the head. I do this a lot in the arm class to just max out the heavy weights that we're doing. We'll grab a lighter weight. So this one, we're going to use these as in-betweener drills. In-betweener with these groups of four exercises that we're doing. So four are done. Now let's pick this little sneak peek, this little extra bonus credit, max out the shoulders. So first one. 20 seconds, going forward. Your goal here is to just trust your endurance. Get through without stopping. If you have to drop down, drop down really quick, but pick it back up, okay? 20 seconds goes by fast, so let's see what you guys got. Ready? Light dumbbells. Pick it up now, forward rotation, your thumbs are rotating up, let's go. 20 seconds, squeeze the core, squeeze those shoulders. Remember, you're not shrugging, you wanna relax. Pull them back, and uh, focus, right, right, good. The fun stuff, guys. You're used to this kind of stuff. Let's go. Right up, putting the L raises, though, so it's gonna be a little bit painful. Stay with it. Two and one. Back legs, go. Same idea. Let's see if you can fight it. So far, so good. One down. You got four to get through, guys. This is number two right here. 20 seconds only. Keep with it, keep with it. Eight seconds left. Yeah, no, that's it done. Really good fight, guys. So stay in the game. Come on. Two, one. All right, you're gonna go forward and back. Open up. Forward. And open. When you open, squeeze those blades together in the back. You want to really bah, punch them back. Punch them. Ah, good. Good fight. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Six seconds left. Just one more, guys. Perfect fight today. Stay with it. Two and one. Okay. So tabletop. Over your head. Stop level the ground. Over your head. Stop level the ground. Exactly. And try to keep those palms up if you can. Good fight. Mel's on straight through. She's got it. You guys, I'm sure, got it too. So let's go. Keep with it. Keep with it. Come on. Ah, squeeze that core. Let's go. Three, two, and one. Good fight, guys. Awesome. Let's go on to drill number five. We are on to drill number five. Your band has to come back on. This is going to be a hard one, guys, because I want you to actually stay in the squat for the majority of this time. Stay in that two ball again as much as you can. We're going to go wider squat. You guys are going to do rocks. So I want you guys to shake that butt really far back. But you're going to rock. You're leaning on the right, rock way on the left. This keeps kind of swaying. And the leg that like you're not using, you can kind of like straighten out instead. Okay? Straighten out. Just keep leaning into it. See if you can stay down there. If you're going to die, just come up and drop right back down. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Stay with it. Yes, good. So this is like almost like a lateral lunge, but we're just taking out that like big step. So you guys can just kind of stay there, really rock into it. You guys can even get to the point where your heel is coming up on the other side. So you all that way. Do it again. Come up. Stay with it. <laughs> get those hips, Scott. Get those glutes fire up. Halfway. It's like 
Remember posture is not, especially in this form, so if you're staying down there, you get tired. Don't just do this. Don't stay down here. Okay? Chest up, shoulders back. I see you really force that form by keeping your arms like this. Good. And seconds left. Now rocking it out. <laughs> the best time to rest. Stay with it. Two, one. Good job. Okay. Next level. Same idea, but I want you to go to one side and you're going to pulse that butt up and down for four. Okay? And then go to the other side, pulse the butt up and down for four. Two, one, let's go. Remember, try to stay down if you can. If it's getting too hard, come up and then drop back down when you can, guys. Good. So you, want, you definitely want to like, you have a lot of movements like this, and then you get to that one side, you go up and down. Four, three, two, one. Other side. Four, three, two, one. Good. That band is going to make sense challenging. If you don't have a band, this drill is still a little hard on its own. Good work. 20 seconds left. Good fight. Stay with that breathing, guys. Really good breathing patterns. Perfect. 10 seconds left. Keep that butt all the way out. Really lean that one side. Four. Good. You're almost there. Come on. Two and one. Okay. So that's half the time now. You can go to the hold. So just lean onto one side and stay there. Ready? Two. One, let's go. So get down, lean onto one side, stay there, don't move. Try to put all that weight into that one leg. Good. Perfect, guys. Good work. Too bad ski season is over because this would have been perfect. Good fight, guys. Stay with it. Really good lean. Don't move from that spot. You have to break stand up quick, but you're almost there. So fight it out. Two, one, switch your sides. Good job. Yeah, good. Mel hasn't come up yet. It's badass, guys. Good, strong legs. Stay with it. We love to hit the legs. And we love band work. Don't we, Mel? Love it. <laughs> Eight seconds left. Come on. Come on. Come on. Stay with that hold. Good job, guys. Two and one. Good Woo. job. Okay, you got one more level of intensity. We're going to change it up a little bit. So now I want you guys to drop down. So drop down back to that slow. One, concentrate on each other, and then roll to one side, roll to the other side. You can do those quick now, and then pop yourself up. Five, okay? Two, one, let's go. Down slow. Two, one, roll. Yeah, good. Do it again. Stay down, slow. Rock, rock, pop. Good. Perfect, guys. Really good fight. Good job with those leaning, guys. Try when you're leaning, not to kind of do this with your feet. You want to keep them flat the whole time. So it's your hips and those glutes that are bringing the whole weight over to each leg. 20 seconds left. Good work, guys. Really good fight. Come on. Stay with it. Stay with it. Nice and well. Finish strong. Finish strong. Eight seconds left. Good job, guys. Come on. Slow it down. Rock it out. Finish this. Side, two side, big power up. Good job. Two and one is done. Good fight, guys. On to the next. Good. Okay, bands are off now, guys. Grab the dumbbells again. Keep on hitting the legs. We're doing split squats now. So, now you guys can get the face band, yeah? And then I'll face the sides. We'll see this. Okay, so alternating your sides to start. So, let's just do the rear lunge to start. Just go down nice and easy, come up. Other side, down nice and easy, and come up. Okay, you guys ready? Two, one, let's go. Just your basic rear lunge, and then by the time you get to that second and third, and then the fourth, we'll do uh, split squats, so we'll stay on one side. Good. Chest up, shoulders back. Make sure you guys are definitely dropping that weight down that front heel. Good posture. Come up. Same idea. Drop down the next heel. Come up. Good. Butt is always popping out, guys. Halfway. Good fight. Nice to go, guys. You got core coming up. Let's sum up these legs right after those rocks you guys just did. 15 seconds left. Always good posture. Good, good, good. 10 seconds. Nice and done. First level of intensity. Really good reps, guys. Come on. Almost. Three, two, 
one. Good. Ten seconds to breathe it out. Let's go one leg in front. Doesn't matter which leg it is. Just pick one. And I want you to stay down here and pulse for the full 25 seconds. Good. Two. One. Let's go. Pulse. Good reps, guys. Really good reps. Stay with it. Remember, always good strong posture. And you're not pulsing like this forward, right? You're pulsing that back knee down. And you're putting all that weight right on that front heel. Good. Stay with it. Fix your eyes to something low. It'll help with you guys balancing. Two, one, right away switch your sides. Finish the second level of intensity, the pulsing. Good. Hips in line, everything directly in one straight good line, guys. Good job. Awesome work. Finish it up, you got it. That back leg that just got work is gonna kick in, guys. Push the hip, so fight it out. Five seconds left. Come on, Mel, you got it. Three. Two, one, good job. Okay, same idea, back to that first leg, but I just wanna stay here and hold, don't move. Get that knee really close to the ground in the back. Don't touch it, but get it down. Two, one, let's go. Same idea, 25 seconds each, hold. Get all those muscles that are keeping you right in line. Squeeze, squeeze here, squeeze here. Focus on the balancing, balancing. Put the weight, visually drop that weight. Down that front heel. Stay with it. Five seconds left. Good fight. Come on. Two, one. Good job. Flip it. Other side. No need to break, guys. You got this. Come on. Good reps. Good reps. Good reps. Breathe. Nice, guys. Really good job. Stay with it. 12 seconds left. Fix those eyes. They will help you with the balance, guys. When you start to get fatigued, you'll be rocking it down side to side. Just stay strong. Almost, come on, Mel. Two, one, good job, guys, awesome. Okay, one more. Let's go back to that first leg again. Sink down into it, and I want you to go really slow on the down, and then just pop up quick, but stay in that stance. So stay in that split squat stance, okay? One side, two, one, let's go. So down, slow. Four, three, two, one, pop. Good. Remember, all that weight, all that weight in that front foot, that front heel. Really good fight, guys. Stay with it, we're almost on to the core work. Good job today, come on. Big jerk up, come on. Good, almost. You have three, two, one, flip it. Last time, same idea. Remember you're focusing on the eccentrics, you're focusing on the down, four count, and then you're trying to drive the up quick. Good reps, good reps. 15 seconds left, finish strong guys, come on. Slow it down, big pop the up. Yeah, now come on. Six seconds left. So far, so good. Come on, come on, come on. One more, so go down slow. Big pop up, two, one. Good job, guys. Hell yeah, nicely done, shake it out. Let's go to some core work. All right, guys, we are on to the core. Really good fight so far, guys. So you're gonna do a plank drill to start here, and it's called threads. So it's like you're threading those, like a thread through the, through the needle, right? So treat your body like as if you gotta go straight through, reach the other side, tap the ground, and then come back to that plank. Do it again, other side, reach through, tap the ground, come back. That's your first drill, your first level of intensity. Normal, take your time, alternate your sides. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Keep those elbows locked in when you guys are doing this. And you want to really just reach through, touch the ground all the way to the side, Come back to that center. Yeah, that was good. So here, I'll demonstrate it this way, guys. You can see, reach through, tap, take your time, reach through, tap, take your time. Try not to like twist into these too much. Like don't like rock the hips too much. Stay nice and strong. Get that core is gonna fire up to keep you in place. Yeah, good. Elbows stay locked in. Maintain that strong plank. You have to break, drop to child's pose, drop to the down dog if you need to, whatever works. Eight seconds left. Good. Nicely done. Stay with it, guys. Come on. Two, one. Okay, 10 seconds to break it out. You're going to get tired of this one, guys. Let's see what you guys got. Okay, now let's alternate your sides. Let's go four and four. So you're going to go back to here. Let's go one, two, three, four, and then same idea on the other side. One, two, three. 
three, four. Good, so this is your pulsing. You're stopping that body to come back full and just staying there and pulsing. Two, one, let's go. Get a little bit extra rest of this one, guys. Good. So let's think about like that. A little extra pulsing of the twist. So you can like tap the hand if, that's, if that works for you, but if you can challenge it, try to twist the hips in that really short range or the core, twisting the core. Try to keep those hips in line. So squeeze, it's like a crunch, crunch, crunch. Good. Yeah, exactly, Bella, come on. That's the halfway marker there. Again, shake it out where you need to. Quick child's pose, if it works. Keep that strong leg. Good fight. 15 seconds left. Awesome, Bella, come on. You're really good, you're almost there, guys, come on. 10 seconds left, good fight, guys, stay with it. Yeah, come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Okay, I'll give you a little bit of a longer break now. Now, same idea, but we are going to hold just as far out as you can. Four seconds, count in your head, come back. Other side, really reach. So the key for this one now is to reach as far as you can and stay in that position. You guys ready? Let's go to two and one. Go for it. So for this one, we're gonna give you guys about 20 seconds in between here to rest. So you guys count your head now. Really reach all the way through, four count. Same idea, other side, just keep alternating. So reach all the way through, as far as you can. Four, three, two, one. Come back, same idea. Four, three, two, one, and come back. Good, really good friends, guys. You'll even see those back of your shoulders, kind of get that good stretch. It's perfect, stay with it. 20 seconds left. Good job. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Guys, we're really close. That full body now should be kicking in. Eight seconds left. Come on. Good hold. Come on. Really good fight, guys. Stay in that game. Come on. Two, one. Good. Shake it out. One more. Now let's go back to that power. So that fourth level. Slowly out. And then just come back. Bah. Okay? Do it again. Slowly out. Flip them back, back. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Good, take your back one out. Pop the back. Good, do it again. Take your time to go out. Back. Pop the back. Good. Try to keep with that all chain. This is the last time in that plank position, guys, so stay with it. Really good time. Come on. Back. Thread yourself through, keeping those hips in line. Elbows are staying locked in. That is awesome, guys. Good. Keep that fight halfway right there. Again, shake it out if you have to. Come right back down. Finish strong, guys. Come on. Focus on your breathing. You guys can even modify by dropping to your knees to finish off if you have to. But stay strong. Stay strong. 15 seconds. Come on. Yeah, now let's go. Good fight, good fight, good fight. Stay with it, stay with it. Eight seconds left. Squeeze that core. Those obliques are kicking in for sure, guys. Come on. Two. One, good job, Ooh. nicely done. All right, we're gonna flip you guys over. Let's grab those dumbbells again. We're gonna hit a really good star crunch now. Bye. Good job. Perfect, guys, we are on drill number eight. Your last one, guys, before we hit the finisher. So good job, stay with it. We're doing star crunch with your light dumbbells or the water bottles or cans, whatever you guys have. Lie on your back, put your arms all the way over your head. Draw your body like a star. So arms open, legs open. You're gonna alternate with that really good crunch. Straight legs, straight arms, they meet in the middle. You ready? Two, one, let's go. Good. You're maximizing that core now with the crunch. You just crushed it with the planks, guys. So good fight. Let's get that core really to kind of sum up these eights. Perfect fight. Arms get involved now again. Let's go. Good. Start, we're just alternating, nice and easy. Squeeze that core every time. Try to get that dumbbell to the shin. You can even try to get it to the foot. Whatever works for you guys. 20 seconds left. Awesome. Good reps, good reps, good reps. Perfect, now let's go. Stay with it. 12 seconds left. I'll give you guys just 10 seconds break now for this one. You don't need too much now. Good reps. Three. Two and one, good job. Okay, your next one, stay up on one side and I want you to pulse for four and then same idea up on the other side, pulse for four. So you're staying up there and you pulse it. Good, two, one, let's go. One side, one, two, exactly, three, four. It's hard, it's gonna be the hardest one for sure. Good, good, 
because you're not letting that body extend back and relax and not engaging. You're staying up there and you're just demanding it to fire up. So let's go. Come on. Yeah. Good. Once you find it, though, guys, you got this. You guys are all pretty badass here, so stay with it. Perfect. Halfway. Good fight. Intensity level number two, guys. Stay with it. Good reps. Remember to breathe. Do not hold your breath. You guys got 15 seconds left. Right in that middle. Meet the opposites and pulse for forward. Come on. 10 seconds left. Yeah, Mel, come on. Good. Mel's crushing these isolate classes, guys. So are you. So stay with it. Let's go. Two, one. Perfect. Okay, 10 seconds break. Now you're gonna get up there and just hold. Four seconds, count your head. Come down, other side. Four seconds, count your head. Two, one, let's go. Come on. You guys can take more break if you need to, but try to come right back in it. Maybe even do like two on each side and then shake it out three feet. Okay? Good set. Yeah, get up, count to four. You want a slow count, guys. Don't rush the count. Good fight. You guys are close. You got done the main eight, guys. You got that last one. Stay with it. Come on, come on, come on. Half way. Good reps, good reps, good reps. So much to do it, Val. Come on. Yeah, look at that hold. You guys are up there. Stay strong. Breathe. Concentrate. Really good changing up for intensity levels, guys. The whole point of isolate. You just really confuse your muscle system. Let's go. Let's go. Three, two, one. Good job. Okay, let's go back to the alternating, but now you're going to explode that up, but take the time coming down into it. Do it again. Explode up, take the time coming back down. Ready? Two, one, alternate, let's go. Come on. Whatever you got left in the tank, guys, come on. Power up. Pa. Take your time, though, coming down. Four, yeah, exactly. Woo. Four, three, two, one. Count in your head. Yeah, good. Those legs are gonna kick in. The hip flexors might be kicking in a little bit, so when you're not using that leg, rest it on the ground so you can let it at least recover. Good. Half. Wave. Power down. Woo. Pa. Come on. Slow it down. Good. That's awesome. Good fight, guys. Awesome work with the star crunches. Come on. You guys have 15 seconds left. Whatever you got left here, guys. Come on, that finisher's coming up. Finish up on this core. We'll always have core in there. Eight seconds. Let's go. Pop. Slow it down. Three, two, and one. Really good work, guys. Good job. Main eight. Done. Keep these dumbbells, though, guys. We're going to go to the finisher. Good fight. All right, guys, you should be back to those weights, that same set that we did for the rotations forward, backward, in and out, over your head. We are doing it again. Stay with it today, guys. You are close. Let's max out these shoulders. Keep that core engaged. You ready? Rotation forward. Let's go. 20 seconds. Good. Let's challenge you guys a little bit now. 20 seconds forward. Come on. Try as best as you can not to break, not even in between when we switch the drill. Good fight. You have eight seconds left. Remember, don't shrug your shoulders up, keep them down. Squeeze that core. Light up those shoulders. Light up even the posterior delts, guys. Two, one, other direction, go. Backwards. Squeeze. You want to be just like this. Squeeze those posterior delts. You want to be able to like really drop the back. So don't shrug them up here. Keep them down. Good. Low. Low. Two. One. All right, go. In and out. Bah. Open and close that door. Thumbs stay up. Squeeze, don't let those arms drop. Keep them level with the ground, nice and parallel. You should definitely be still on your knees, guys, but don't let that butt rest on your heels. Stay up and be strong. Five seconds, five seconds, come on. One, two, one, okay, over your head, go. Over, stop, over, stop, good. Breathe, concentrate, finish strong. Don't break that plane, so don't let them drop past that. Shoulder level, stay right here. Back up, stop. Back up, stop. Come on. Two, one. One more time. Right back at it. Let's go. Only 15 seconds now. You can 20 deep. Let's go 15. Come on. One more time each. One more time. Good fight, guys. Come on, come on, one. Finish strong. Shoulders. They should be definitely burning by now, guys. Come on. Two, one. Backwards. Go. 15 seconds. You can do anything for 15 seconds, guys. You can do absolutely anything for 15 seconds. So fight it out. Whatever you guys got left today. Let's go. Empty that tank. Three, two, 
One, two, good. In and out. No staying with this, you're not even resting. Let's go. Open up. Thumbs stay up. Squeeze those blades. Perfect. Come on, come on. Five seconds left. You're almost there. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, good rest. Two, one, go. Over your head. One more time. Drop it down. Level the ground. Up. Level the ground. Don't break that plane. Keep going down one time. Thumbs up. Good. Six seconds left. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Woo. Good job, guys. Two and one. All right, drop those demos. Not done yet. Let's go right to a plank. That's on one good solid minute. We're not going to rest much. Those arms are going to fire up. Finish up on that core. Let's go, Mel. You got to finish it. Two. That's good. I mean, you might as well. We kind of finish you guys with a little bit of extra credit. Good fight, guys. This is it, though, I promise. So whatever you got left, breathe, concentrate. Those muscles are definitely activated now. They're probably going to be like, what the heck are you doing sitting in the plank now? But you got to fight it. Come on. Keep that head in the game. Good job. Elbows stay locked in. Squeeze that core. Keep the butt to slip the up. Never let that back extend. You always want to keep the core squeezed. Good feeling, right, Max? A little bit? Who ever thought a minute time would be hard? Let's go. Go on. 20 seconds left now. 20 seconds. Come on. You guys are counting. You're almost there. Finish strong. Whatever you guys got left, finish strong. Come on, come on. 12 seconds left. Breathe. Concentrate. Follow your breathing, guys. Just focus on the breathing. You got this. Come on. Come on. Five, four, three, two, and one. Nice and done. Good job, guys. That's how you finish. Nice and done. Good set. Okay, let's go right to your cool down, guys. You guys can stay actually on your mat. You can stay right there, Mel. You guys, just drop into that really good child's pose. Stay there. Whew. Just breathe and try to walk out those hands as far as you can. Stretch out the shoulders. Sit that butt back on the heels now. You guys can even kind of rock it out side to side. Your day is done. So congratulate yourself and just breathe. Good. Now from here, do those threads where you just rest the arms and you'll feel the shoulder kick in. Good. Can you walk out this one? Feel this one kick in. Good. Yeah, Mel. Good job, girl. <laughs> yeah. Good. Nice lane number four. You guys crushed it. All right, other side, same idea. So thread that through. Take your time. No need to rush. You guys can definitely stay extra today and just do some more stretching or foam rolling. Go. Okay, from there, let's do your good up dog. So drop those hips back. Just hold yourself up nice and comfortable. Good, stretch out that lower back. And do core. Rock it out a little bit side to side. Just keep breathing. Let's do that good down dog from there. Drive the hips up and back. Good. Drive that chest down. All right, now let's do that one leg at a time. So let's put the one leg hip flexor stretch. So one leg up. There you go. And then sink down to this one again, guys. Hips are definitely the most finicky part of the body that's involved in a lot of core work. So you want to make sure that it's definitely stretched out here, guys. Open up, close back in. Good. Perfect. And let's change your stance. Same idea. Take your time with it, guys. Good. Forward. Open up. Close back in. Yeah, perfect. All right, let's go one more time to that good down dog, but widen out that stance. So go really wide with it. Good down dog. Stay there. Keep it. Try to even keep those feet flat in this position. Walk yourselves back. You really feel the hamstring stretch, half the hip stretch. From there, let's reach to the opposite foot, and you're gonna do that rotation. So you rotate up like this. Um, there you go. Okay. Yeah. And then take your time. Do the other side. Rotate up. Wow. You try to lift Ooh. up a little bit. Good fight. I right, stay down a little bit more. You can grab the arm and just kind of rock it side to side. Wrap it out. Good. All right, come on, nice and slow. Ooh, shake your head a little bit. Rotate the shoulders back some more. Good. Awesome, guys. Breathe it out. Chill out the rest of the day, guys. You guys just crushed it. Really good fight, guys. Happy isolate round four. Until next time. Good.